folks, how you doing out there? Is this thing working? Is this thing on? Technology. Write me a comment if you can hear this thing. Hey, Austin, how you doing? Well, my name is Zachary Lucky, for those of you who don't know. And uh, I'm guessing you do because you're here, and I'm here, and uh, we're here together. Been looking forward to this for a long time. Uh, my friends over in Sweden at Nordvis Records put out this album, uh, The Battle of Losing You, back in uh, last summer, I guess it was. And uh, it was very, very kind of them to do that. And it was nice to kind of breathe some new life into that record. And, and uh, so we thought we'd do this, this little bit of a live stream here for you. We'll see. We'll see how this goes. I haven't played these songs in a, in a mighty long time, and uh, we'll see. Front to back. Here we go, folks. Hit play. It's called A Ramblin' Man's Lament.
Right on. Hopefully this thing is working. Uh, I'm, I'm not too hip with the YouTube live. I'm not too sure if, uh, if it is working. Some of you are commenting. I see that. And uh, I saw something about Hamilton. Uh, and I saw something about a classical guitar. I'm not too sure. Austin, you're there. Finland approves. All right. So it is on. You guys can hear me. That's great. Um, right on. Okay, I'm feeling good. Middle of the afternoon here in Ontario. And uh, I just put the kid down for a nap. And the other one's watching some, uh, I don't know what she's watching, some TV show or something. But it uh, feels good to sing some songs in the afternoon for you. Good to know someone from Norway's in the house right on. Let's move it right on. Uh, so this record, I wrote this record back uh, kind of the tail end of uh, uh, 2012, I think, and, and into the start of uh, 2013 when we recorded the thing. This, this song uh, comes from, uh, I was living out uh, with my partner at the time, living out uh, on the eastern coast of Canada, in a small little fishing island called Grand Manan in the province of New Brunswick. And Grand Manan's a, it's a funny little island, you know, it's about uh, 2,000 people live there. And, and uh, I don't remember too much about it. It, it was pretty isolated, uh, very beautiful in the summertime, very desolate in the winter, a lot of fishermen. A lot of churches, for some reason. I don't know why there's so many churches, but... Anyways, this is a... I had, I had this habit. We lived in this community called Seal Cove, and I would wander down to the uh, the beach in Seal Cove. And this island, it's in the Bay of Fundy, uh, which is uh, has, has the highest tides in the world, I believe. Or maybe it's just the Atlantic, but super high tides. And one minute, you know, the beach is a mile long, and the, the next minute, it's... The water's right up at your feet. And uh, every day I'd wander down to the water, sit on the same rock, and, and watch the, the tide come and go. And uh, this is a song about that. I haven't sung this one in a while. It's called Salty Air.
Salty air, right on. All the way from Grand Manan, New Brunswick, Canada. That one. Hey, I tell you, if you're sitting there watching this and you're you're enjoying it, uh, why don't you give us a thumbs up? Give this video a little bit of a, a like. Let me know you're there and you're with me. Um, we're gonna get into the ballad part of this record. The album's called The Battle of Losing You. And uh, uh, the, the title, I think, is pretty self-explanatory. Uh, I, I was sort of in the, the process of uh, exiting a, a rather long-term relationship, you know, and, and uh, losing someone, whether it's uh, a lost love or whether it's a death or something like that. It's, it's always difficult, you know, and it brings a, a interesting things out of us. It, it's an interesting time to reflect and, and to grow. Anyways, uh, I thought I'd call it The Ballad of Losing You because all these songs uh, sort of had a, a ballad vibe to them. Um, some of them more so than others. But I, at, at the time, I was listening to a lot of uh, English folk music, uh, Shirley Collins, Ann Briggs, Bert Yanch, people like that. Uh, so not necessarily country music whatsoever. And uh, anyways, this is a, it's a song called... Uh, Track number three, it's called After All the Months We've Shared. Don't tell me it's time to leave After all the months we've shared we shared. Moving right along. Woke up. Uh, at the time uh, that I, this record kind of was formulating and coming together, um, 
I should say, I mean, we toured this record for a couple of years, but by the time we were done with it, you know, uh, the reason a lot of these songs sort of disappeared from the live show is that, uh, I mean, I kind of got tired of singing these, these heartbroken songs. You can only rehash, you know, those emotions and feelings so many times. And uh, some of the songs stuck with us for a lot of years, you know, even, even till today, like this, this song here woke up uh, is still often in the live show and, and uh, I enjoy singing it quite a bit. Um, I wrote this, me, me and my partner at the time, who, who this record was sort of about, um, we used to tour together a fair bit. And uh, I remember this one particular tour, we were supposed to head out on the road together and, and I ended up going alone. Um, she decided she didn't want to come. And uh, I made my way out to, uh, you know, what we call Eastern Canada, close to where I live now, from, traveled from Saskatchewan, you know, three province, two provinces away out to Ontario, uh, staying in Toronto, and, and this song came to me one morning, and I wrote this thing, and I, I just thought it was the prettiest song, you know, I thought it was, which is kind of, kind of a, a bullshit thing to think about your own music, but, uh, uh, I thought it was real pretty, you know, and I just, I was like, man, that's, that's a nice song, and, and, uh, so I sent, I demoed the thing on my, on my phone at the time, and, I sent it off to my my girlfriend and she listened to it and and uh, she didn't like it very much and uh, <laughs> but uh, at least that's how I remember it. Maybe that's not the way it went, but and understandably so. It's a it's a pretty uh, pretty gut wrenching tune. Anyways, it's a uh, it's called Woke Up. Lost on the road, lost in a dream. You by my side, the towns on the radio. Just saying something, I'm waiting for the day foreshadowing.
Lost on the road, lost in a dream. You by my side, in towns on the radio. Just singing something, I'm waiting for the day. Just singing something. Of course, you forget this, the words of the song that you sing all the time. That's the way it goes, isn't it? Uh, I, I was, my, my mind was caught up thinking about uh, the line in the third verse where it talks about uh, singing the, uh, the Bob Dylan song, Song to Woody. And I was, I was thinking about that, trying to remember that song in my brain. And that distracted me from the fourth verse. But that's okay. That's how it is. Live music, folks. Live music. This is for real. This is happening right now. This next song is, it's, I think it's one of my favorites off the record. Uh, I haven't played this one since uh, probably 2014, but um, I, I really like it. It's, uh, it was fun to learn this again, figure out how to play the guitar properly again. It's called More Than Enough Room. <clears throat> More than enough room for one man or two. Driving this whole country looking for you. You with your black eyes and faded blue jeans. One too many songs, but what might it have been? What might have been? What might have been? I've been getting older each and every day With enough things said or done for a lifetime they say Someday we'll look back with faded memories The life that we didn't choose what might have been What might have been? What might have been? My arms for you they long and your home on the eastern coast. 
my arms for you they long not a very merry song, but it is uh, the month of May. All right, moving along. I'm going to say really quick, uh, we got a, I got a few more here for you. Um, I appreciate all you folks hanging out with us today in this live stream. Uh, this is a lot of fun for me, and uh, and it's it's a pleasure to uh, spend some time hanging out with my, my European uh, friends, uh, Nordvis Records over in Sweden. I wish we were hanging out together and uh, sitting around the fire and doing this in person, but we'll do that someday. And uh, this next song um, is called uh, Morning Words. Uh, also at the time, like I said, I was listening to a lot of English uh, psychedelic folk music, and uh, but I was also listening to some American music uh, by way of uh, the Stanley Brothers. I was listening to a lot of the Stanley Brothers and um, this is a song sort of inspired uh, by that uh, tradition of playing bluegrass music. Um. Called Morning Words. Coming back to your door 
these songs, uh, this record, The Battle of Losing You, is available for purchase through Nordvis Records. Uh, there's some links in the description. Head over to the Nordvis store and uh, go pick up The Battle of Losing You on CD or vinyl. Check it out. They're good folks. And uh, we all need support in this, this day and age right now. All of us in the uh, entertainment industry and uh, music industry. And uh, uh, there's also a link there for a, a PayPal that I've set up for some of these live stream shows. Uh, a bit of a virtual tip jar. You know, if you if you think these songs are worth something, this entertainment's worth something, uh, toss a couple bucks in there. You know, five bucks, ten bucks, hundred bucks, whatever it is, and uh, it all works for me. And uh, <laughs> that's greatly appreciated on both fronts. Come back around. Uh, this is another song that I really I don't think I've sung this since maybe since the record came out and uh, it's interesting it's kind of like looking in a mirror and seeing a younger version of yourself I, I was living in Saskatoon Saskatchewan Canada at the time and a uh, bit of a song about uh, it was this point in my life where uh, I, I mean I, I should say I quit working and picked up the guitar full time uh, back in like 2010 something like that and uh, I started touring an awful lot 2010, 11, 12, 13, 14. And uh, every time I came home, it felt like I knew less and less people in my own city, you know? And uh, my family and friends were more on the road than they were at home. And uh, this is a song that, I think that's what it was about, sort of, that sentiment. Come back around. When you come back around 
Second Avenue through downtown. How you've changed, but stayed the same. When you come back around, been away. Down the wire, I've been away for a few. And I know we're all the same Like falling leaves We all change Turn from brown Back into green well, I know we're all the same When it comes time for leaving Say our goodbyes knowing there's a reason for all these miles left in between. When it comes time for leaving, Come back around. Um, right on. A couple more for you. This next song here, uh, it was around this time that uh, there was a Towns Van Zandt. Uh, what would you call that? It's a uh, outtakes, um, unreleased B sides, I guess. Uh, there's a B sides Towns Van Zandt record that came out. I think it's called Sunshine Boy. And uh, we were pretty, pretty, pretty big into the town of Van Zandt at the time, as as I always am, and uh, big fan of his writing. And there, there was this song in there, and uh, I remember me and my partner at the time. We we were both listening to this record a fair bit, and uh, almost like at the same time, we were both like, "I'm going to cover that song." Uh, and then she's like, "No, I'm going to cover that song." And. Uh, I think maybe we both did for a time. I can't remember. Either way, I, I, it felt fitting with this record, uh, putting it on there, and uh, I, I enjoy playing it a lot. It kind of, we, I think we do a little bit more of a honky tonk thing than Towns does when we have the full band. But uh, it's been a long time since I've listened to the Towns recording of this song. I should go back and revisit it. Anyways, it's called "Waiting for the Day," and uh, it's funny how these things, uh, how life plays itself out. Waiting for the day I no longer can recall All the times you made me crawl All the times I hang my head and cry Still teardrops fall And Lord, what's worst of all just ain't got the nerve to say goodbye I'm waiting for the day To hide my love away Stand up like a man So tall and free You'll be the one to say Darling 
stay I don't know what I would do if you Someday, by and by, you're gonna be the one to cry. You walk the floor and sadly you'll call my name. I'm waiting for the day to hide my love away. Stand up. I'll try Believe that I don't know Days come and when Won't do me wrong again I'll be the one to turn Good people of the world, I really hope that you're all doing good out there. You know, honest to goodness, um, life is beginning to get uh, normal in some places. Uh, I think we're still quite a ways away from it here. Uh, but this is the new normal, and life is generally pretty good. You know, I hope you folks are doing good too. And um, I really appreciate you spending some time with me tonight, or this afternoon, or this morning, wherever you are. And uh, Hopefully you've enjoyed listening to the uh, the live edition of The Ballad of Losing You. Uh, huge thanks to Andreas and uh, Nordvis for uh, having me uh, here on the YouTube channel today and, and for uh, supporting me and putting out that record. The mighty kind good folks can't wait to get over there to Sweden and hang out with you all. Uh, we'll, we'll do this last one for you. And again, uh, head over to the Nordvis store and pick up uh, your copy of The Ballad of Losing You. And... Also, uh, put some money in that uh, virtual tip uh, tip jar. <laughs> the Bob Dylan encore. Yeah, I I don't think I could do it. Uh, I could maybe do an encore for you. Uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. This is a long song. This one. So uh, buckle in. Anyways, toss a couple bucks in the tip jar if you can. And, and uh, if not, that's all good. It's hard times for all of us. Pass that. Somebody pass that link around in the chat if you would. All right. Here we go. I think there's some folks over in Germany who like this one.
called Sun's Coming Up. Wake up, the day here, oh, the sun's coming up over them hills, and there's coffee in your cup. I wanna know what you're dreaming of. Wake up, my dear, oh, the sun is coming up. Well, last night, in my dream, we were far, far away. I was a soldier.
Right on, everybody. Appreciate the support. Appreciate you tuning in. Uh, that's the end of the record. That's it. That's all she wrote. Maybe I'll do one more for you if you're into it. If you're going to stick around and listen, I'll do one more. And then, uh, and then we'll, sit, we'll part ways and say goodbye. But Please, if, you had give, if you're watching this, click the like button on this video. I know that's going to help Nordvis out. And uh, subscribe to their channel if you haven't already. And uh, after you've done that, after this video, head over and, and find my channel. Subscribe there. That helps me out, too. And uh, here's one more for you, everybody. Maybe this is some foreshadowing. I'm not too sure. But uh, this is a song uh, from a record that actually came out before The Ballad of Losing You. Uh, Andreas has been bugging me about how to, how to play this one. And uh, so here we go. This is, uh, this is for you, brother. It's called Saskatchewan. Thanks, everybody. to Nordvis Records. Appreciate the support. Appreciate you tuning in. And we'll see you soon, all right? Take care of yourselves out there. Take her easy.